Bonjour YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I am Noralex. This is going to be my reaction for season 2, episode 7 of Attack on Titan called Close Combat. If you are new to Noralex Live, please subscribe. You can even click the bell to make sure you do not miss my next video. So, last episode was, uh, yeah. So Yemira is in a coma, she's not dead, so that was good, I guess. But then Raina told Ere that he and Bertiri are the armored and colossal titan respectively. He also told Ere that the mission to destroy humanity can be avoided if Ere joins them. 12 hours before? Angie revealed that both of them come from the same area as Annie and that they are probably working together. Back at the wall, Reina and Bertori transform into titans. Reina grabbed Eren to escape, but feeling betrayed, Eren also transforms into a titan and he's about to fight with Reina. Just saying that recap seems insane. <laughs> Before I jump into this reaction, you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Neuralex. Watch the full length watch along reactions on Patreon and also get some merch at 20% discount on Teespring. Just use the code Neuralex20. Come on. Do it. All right. Close combat. Here we go. <laughs> That was back in episode 3, 4. What about you? <laughs> that come with a rhino looking at him. Uh, you want to kill Titan, bro? Right? Oh my god, I felt that betrayal. Oh my god. Of course, they cut to the music. Let's go. Don't get me wrong, like, I, 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 I highly expected that Raina was the armored titan. Because of the hair, since Annie, you know, I don't trust anybody with any titans with blonde hair. But I didn't expect him. I don't know, somehow I didn't expect him to know. Like, remember like two, three episodes ago, I came out with that theory about like some of them might be like sleeper cell agents. But now it doesn't seem like it. Like they know and they're fighting for something and they have a goal in mind. They don't want to destroy humanity just because they're evil or something. Like, there's a reason behind it. And I think the secret to that lies within that Wallace religion truth that they're not saying and Krista's origin. Give me some. Give me some. Mikasa! What's going on? <laughs> Yeah, you still have that that big one there, eh? Because they're your friends. Oh my god. Get off the wall! Oh my god! Oh shit! Did he eat them or he just like he's keeping them in their mouth? Uh. He's not even form. He's like form on the top of the wall. That's uh, that's freaky. Oh! Oh my god! Wow, the way... Uh. Shit. 
look at this point of view. Oh shit. He steamed them out of the way. Oh my god. Probably, yeah. まで体を燃やし続けていられるか見物だが、いずれ彼は出てくる。いいか。彼らを捕らえることはもうできない。殺せ。ためらうな。Oh my god, kill them without hesitation. You'll deal with the armor titan? ライナーとベルドルトはどこですか Bro, you don't know. Oh my god. You don't know. Whoa! Oh my god. I wouldn't I would not fight Rarina in human form. Do you imagine how strong he is as the armored titan? Ere! Come on, regenerate. Nope. He's protected in the back. Oh, oh man, I love it when they do the rewind. Yeah, he's armored. Wake up. Oh my god, he's gonna get so angry. You disgust me, oh my god. Yeah, get out, Mikasa. Ooh, oh my god. I believed it for a second. Oh my god. Just like back in training. あんたも男ならさ、私のこの通い体をもっといたわるべきなんじゃないの。お前の冗談は面白くねえな。力が変わらない。相手より力で劣るものが自分を守るための技術だったりするからね。モイタイスタンス。おし。お。<笑><笑
my god. He's gonna get... Ooh, he ducked! Oh my god! Yes! What do they call it? Like an arm triangle takedown? Oh, techniques! Oh my god, yes! Now squeeze! He's full mount now. Ground and pound! Oh, yes! My god, he's going full jujitsu mode. And he's cracking. Don't lose the hold. Oh my god, he's gonna powerbomb him. Oh my god, did he just switch it to an... Arm bar! Oh my god, I'm watching MMA right now with Titans. Oh! Oh my god! Yata, certain, là. Dude, choke him. No, he won't. E boy. Shit. He followed. Oh, Hannes! Uh, yeah. Yes, it is. Yes. Do it. <laughs> NG, come on. Tanonda yo! Tanonda yo! Let's go, Ere! You're the one without a future. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! The legs! You need an ankle lock and break the kneecap. Oh, that's it. Yeah, you just have to find the weakness in the armor. Duck it. Fine. Yes. Oh my god. In the neck. Man, we're watching full blown jujitsu MMA right there. Hold it. Oh my god. Oh! Yes, Mikasa. Oh, the leg is down. Oh! Did he break the nape armor? What? He's gonna tap! Come on, guillotine! Let's go! Oh my god. Rhino is fighting back. Oh my god. He's got him. Perfect guillotine technique. The Colossus. Oh my god. Oh no. 
He's calling other titans or calling for the colossal to do something. Oh, I'm very scared of what's gonna happen. Oh my god! No! Oh my no! Eddie, move! Okay, just before I forget, I just want to tell real quick that somebody in the comment a couple videos ago when um, when Annie and Ede fought in um, inside the wall, like at the end of season one. And somebody told me that apparently the writer of Attack on Titan is a big MMA fan and he basically did the fight in a way that Annie, which clearly has a Muay Thai technique stance. If you watch like a little martial art on MMA, you would realize that right away. The kicks, the way she used her elbow at one point, knee, whatever. That's very Muay Thai. And what we just saw there in this fight between Ene and Raina is like basically he did an arm bar, he did an arm triangle, he tried to choke him and then finished with the guillotine. Those are all like Brazilian jiu-jitsu techniques that are highly used in MMA. So, I never thought I would see that, but this show just spoiled me so much because I never thought I would see an MMA fight between two titans in this show. That was a straight up MMA fight. Reiner running and trying to, to tackle and uh, double leg take down him and then Eden seeing that coming and grabbing him from the guillotine like locking the legs behind his back those are like I see that in every UFC show that I watch those are like basic MMA techniques not saying that they're easy but like I'm saying that those are techniques that are heavily used in MMA and wow that show is amazing <laughs> That show is amazing. Wow. I can't... <laughs> I'm just... I'm still freaked out about, about that MMA showdown that we just saw, man. It was amazing. Finish with a guillotine to counter a takedown. Mwah! Wow. Oh, if you guys don't know, I'm a huge UFC MMA fan, so... That was just for me, I guess. And that cliffhanger, of course, but... My question is, did Mikasa and Annie ever fought? Like in that flashback, did they do it? Like, did, did they fight and somebody came out as a winner somehow? And is that why I feel like Mikasa wants to fight Annie all the time? As kind of a grudge thing for like the best fighter in the, in the cadets or something? And I can tell you something, when two women don't like each other, stay out of their way. <laughs> but basically, my, I have the same questions from the last episode, basically. I need to know why. Why, why are they doing this? And why did they have a mission to destroy humanity and now they don't? And why do they want to abduct Ere? And why, 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 why? <laughs> That was a really good episode. That show, that I have to say that this season two has a high octane pacing. Like it's, it goes kind of faster, of course, because there's only 12 episodes to that season. But what I mean is the pacing is a bit faster, even though I thought like season one had a very good pacing. But it's, and then the punches and the intricate way of, of telling that story, like having a punchline and having flashback to 12 hours earlier or flashback to the training or flashback to back in the days. And on the other thing I want to know that is not settled yet, like why did Raina was attacked by Yemir's Titan form when he was a kid? Like why and how did that happen? So many questions. Attack on questions. 
Attack on cliffhangers. I do not know what is going on and I want to know. That's it. Neuralex is going insane. Anyway, that was my reaction for episode 7, season 2 of Attack on Titan. Shinjuku no Kyojin! Guys, please. Tell me what you thought about it in the comments below. Give this video a like. Subscribe if you're new around here. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Neuralex. Watch my full-length reactions on Patreon. And check out some merch on Teespring. With a 20% discount, just enter code Neuralex20. Thank you again for watching this. I am Neuralex. And until we meet each other again, guys, stay safe.